Good morning, preppers. Good morning. Good morning, Ashley. Good morning. Welcome to Goshen Prepping. <laughs> now, one of the things that we thrive on, one of the things that we take pride in, one of the things yeah. we get excited about are sales. The sales, thrift stores. Yeah, not thrift stores. Not thrift stores, but your thrifty food at, deals. You yeah. get your food at thrift stores. That doesn't, I don't know. Uh, that's just not me. I saw some at a yard sale the other day. They were actually selling canned chicken. And I would have considered buying it because it's canned chicken, but it was like just as much as the store, if, if not more. Yeah. So they, they, I don't know what was going on with them. But anyways, thrifty, being thrifty and finding sales. So the other day, I came across an Augustin Farms black bean burger mm -hmm. mix. And I'm a meat eater. I'm a carnivore. But when I see like black bean burgers, that, that actually sounds tasty to me. I know getting a lot of like substitute meats and stuff is not right up my alley. Yeah, it's but not bad. I wrote this down. We ordered four of them. We haven't got them yet. So I got four of them. Normally they're $29 a can and they're on sale for 10 bucks a can. Oh, wow. So I did what every thrifty person would do. I bought four. Yeah. That's some extra lot to buy. So I bought four and I, and I immediately put it up on our Goshen, Goshen Prepping Facebook page and said, hey guys, look at this. And I actually had some people respond and say, I got some. But then very quickly their they sale ended. Yeah. yeah, exactly. They didn't have any more. So we'll talk about that in a minute. So stay tuned about posting things on the Facebook page. Yes. Okay. But let's talk about some of the different August and Farm sales. Now, the first thing I want to mention to you is don't fall for Amazon trickery. <laughs> we almost did. Yeah. Amazon trickery is this. For example, look at this picture. Corn right here says it's on sale for $17 a can, regularly priced at $38. That's but a good deal, you think? You think, yeah, that's a good deal. But don't be deceived. That's always their price for corn. In fact, if you go to Walmart and compare prices, you'll actually see their sales are on there too. It's the same price, 17 bucks. So when we look at buying things on sale for Amazon, mm -hmm. uh, for, especially for August and Farms, you want to make sure it has this little tag down below. For example, you'll see right here, we have chicken and the chicken is on sale for 15, 50. It was 20 bucks. And you can see the little red flag or orange flag, whatever color you want to call it, to be able to buy it. And sure enough, we did. So this is a chicken here. Yep. Yeah. Now, again, this kind of stuff is not right up my alley, but you know, it's storage, chicken food flavored. storage, it's chicken flavored a meat, meat sub substitute, which, you know, honestly does not float my boat, but it actually has vegetable protein, soybean oil, <laughs> natural flavor and salt. Uh, it also contains soy. I like soy. Yeah. But anyways, there you go. Is it my preferred choice? No. But when crap hits the fan, it's better than not eating. That's and true. And at least I have something that tastes like chicken. Yeah. <laughs> and we buy canned chicken too. We do. Which will last forever also. Okay. So this is not our most preferential thing, but it was on sale. So we picked up, I think we got two of them. I think we did. We got two. Okay. What else did we get, Ash? Uh, we got tomato powder. Yeah. We got a few cans of those, which is amazing. Um, it actually has recipes too. That's one thing I like about August of Farms. It has a few recipes on the back, so it can help you be creative. And guess how much this was? I have no idea. Yeah, me too. I forgot to write it down. <laughs> okay, so we got it on sale. But this actually was one of the sale things. And we like tomato powder. And you'll actually see a video coming up later this week where we're making our own tomato powder mm -hmm. using our beautiful freeze dryer. But the price of the tomatoes, especially tomato prices are going through the roof right now because mm -hmm. there's a shortage, combined with the fact that you actually have to run the freeze dryer for quite a while and stuff. Um, I'm all for freeze drying. And there's a lot of things we like to freeze dry and things not so much. Tomato powder... Eh, it's okay. I like buying from the can. Yeah, it was like, I want to say it was like 12 bucks. It was really inexpensive. It was definitely on sale. Yeah. And we bought four cans and then the sale ended. It did. So, um, again, as we go through this, I'll talk about the sale things in a minute. What else do we have? Now, here's some things that you can look at that we did not buy. Potato shreds. These actually were on sale, $43 instead of 54 Okay. Still quite a lot. Yeah, but why didn't we buy it? It wasn't because of the $43. It was for the fact that you don't have to buy... August and Farms potatoes oh, yeah. to make them last forever. Exactly. Yeah. You buy the actual potato potatoes, flakes. right? Yeah. Potato flakes. Mm -hmm. If you want them to last a long time, like forever, put them in a mylar bag with an oxygen absorber and they're good. Exactly. And you don't pay a higher price. They also have what are called funeral potatoes. I have never heard of funeral potatoes in my life. Have I you? I've never heard of that. I heard they're to die for. <laughs> I was going to say, they're really sad. <laughs> sad taters. So it's a little bag, $6.70 instead of eight. But same thing. I'm not going to buy that because I can buy potato flakes, Idahoan spuds, whatever they, they want. Happy taters. Yeah, exactly. Not funeral potatoes. They had a fruit pail. Now look at the price on this: seventy-eight dollars for this giant pail of uh, freeze-dried fruit, except for uh, unless, uh, if I can talk, 
it was $188. Ooh. 188 Who pays that? Good gosh. Now, I was like, first thing I was like, sale, look at this. It's less than half price. And I was like, wait a second. We were going through it and we're like, hmm. It didn't really seem to be, it seemed to be still a lot of money for the amount of freeze-dried food, food yes. you got in there. So we decided to go against but it. But you get a nifty pail. Same thing with banana chips. Yes. That banana was... chips are just delicious. They are. That and freeze-dried strawberries. They are. But the banana chips were on sale, $52 instead of 80 that's but same a, thing. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money versus some Fruit. crunchy bananas. I know. <laughs> I got enough crunchy bananas around the house. <laughs> okay, the next one we did not buy. Rolled oats were on sale. Yeah. $32 instead of $52. So it's a true sale item. It is, yeah. Why didn't we buy it? We have lots of it from Azure. You can get Azure. a big, big container exactly. of it. And so you ready for that. this? I don't know how big their pail is of rolled oats. I would say it's probably five pounds. Yeah, probably. Let's, let's go ahead and just say it's 10 pounds. It's not, but let's pretend it is. <laughs> For, for 32 bucks on sale, from Azure Standard, you can get 50 pounds of rolled oats for 41. And then you can buy a bucket and it's even cheaper. Exactly. Yeah. So so it's on sale, but I think for a lot of people who, like you and me, Are thrifty. you and me, the three of us, you, you, we're, we've been prepping for a while. It's not, I think people who don't prep might want to jump on these sales, but you find better ways to get them. It yes. works. Same thing with Shop their black the beans. Their black beans were on sale for $66 a pail. Again, I think this is like a five or 10 pound bucket instead of 88. So cool, I say 22 bucks. But they're no. beans. Go to Azure Standard, a 25 pound bag for $29. Oh my gosh. And then you can get <laughs> buckets. And then you what? You fill like two or three buckets with that? It's like two and a half buckets you fill with right, that bag. Right, exactly. Yeah. And look at that. I mean, throw an oxygen absorber and you're saved a ton of money. Now, we did buy some milk. We did. And actually, we accidentally bought, somehow we bought too much. Of I it. don't know how we did that, honestly. I don't know either. Well, I think I wanted to buy two cans. We ended up buying eight. <laughs> I think my finger got nervous. Went, I don't know what I did. Or maybe I added some, you added some. I don't know. I got excited for this because milk is something that, because we have a bunch of littler kids, that would be something that I think that they need. So So these run 16 bucks a can. They were. What I do like about Amazon, I mean, there's a lot of things I don't like about Amazon, I'll be honest with you. Um, but what I do like about them is they have their subscription service. Yes. So like when it comes to my vitamins that I take, certain vitamins, you click on the subscription, you'll save five or 10% mm -hmm. and it automatically ships to you. Which is nice if you forget, which I forget a lot. Right. So. And then you get a discount by buying, it's almost like buying in bulk, but you get it ahead of time. Exactly. I like it. Okay. So here's the real moral of the story. It's not about buying Augs and Farms. And it's really not even about buying Azure Standard, which by the way, you still should, by the way. <laughs> Link in the description below. Um, it's about thriftiness yes, and it's about community. So what I would like to do at this point from here on in, I am going to on our Facebook group page, whenever I come across these sales, and now that I actually realize when you go into Amazon, every once in a while, just type, type in August and farms, you'll find the ones that are on sale. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start posting them on the page. And what I would like you to do is do the same. Yes. Because as a community, and it doesn't have to be just August and farms. Let's say you go to Kroger and they have chicken on sale. Let's say you go to Save a Lot and they have meat. I don't know, canned food. Meat on sale. I don't know. <laughs> As opposed to chicken. I know. Yeah. And you, or you go to Walmart. Walmart doesn't usually have sales, but you go to Aldi and they have canned corn on sale. Whatever, whatever. Sam's, Costco. I don't care where you get your sales from, but if you see a sale, especially if it's a really good deal, yes. Let's start helping each other out posting it on the Facebook group page. And if you're not part of our Facebook group, you simply click on the link below and become a member. And if you don't have Facebook, then you need to do it. <laughs> Join for that alone. I know. Honestly, there's amazing tips and community among that, so. Yeah, there's really cool stuff. Now, I'm not at all endorsing Facebook. Not at not least a little bit. But at least it's a way we can communicate right now. Yes. And uh, so that's what I would like to do. And I hope you join this too. So let's really help each other out because we are a community after we all. Are. And we want to help each other out with sales and being thrifty and to be able to prep for the best bang for our buck. Yeah, share the knowledge that you find. Exactly. Help so and we'll do the same thing yep. too. All right, hopefully you can get some black bean burger mix or tomato powder. Or, or, or fake milk. chicken. <laughs> yeah, or fake chicken and too. All right, guys. Anything else? No. I hopefully right. you guys find a good deal. Share. Yeah. So join on in. Join join on in to our Facebook page. Say hi so we know you're there. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.